Rubik's gonna play it. But if Jarek's does as well, then I know he he's also a very good Rubik player. Final pick from Secret. It's the Envy Terror Blade Waga. We are gonna be in for a Terror Blade versus Alchemist final game. Man, Terror Blade's gonna be great against all those melees too. Whenever he drops the reflection, it's gonna hit so many people. It is a greedy lineup overall from Liquid, but that would be a tool to come online sooner. Maybe open up some options for them going the offensive. Speaking of which, they seem to have caught out a puppy lich here. Hit him up with a stomp, but that may be the end of it. Or not. Jerex happens to TP in, smacks him in the face with a fade bolt, pulls him back with a telekinesis, and they're going to be able to get the burst. Curl picks up that kill and picks up the first blood for Team Liquid. Yeah. NV Terrorblades here. Approach. Finally, the real one shows himself, and there's going to be the Chrono. Quick Moonlight Shadow does fly out. Do they have the detection? It might not be necessary. They get the stop and a quick thunder. Stabs the life right back from Kuro. And the Envy, though, is still in trouble. Try to run back the way, gets him with the Fable, and then they make their move. My Control will pick up the last hit. Arrow flies, but only catches a creep. Secret will quickly drop two. The better, but uh, he will save his tier one for now. That will be just fine. That is, in fact, a five stack on the Dire Ancient, so there's a lot of money to uh, clear out. Curl is hit with the Ignite and a Fire Blast, and Puppy says, let's go for the chain. Arrow, just off the mark. Curl oh, very the low, and they stole the chain and send it right back their way. What a play from Jarex. I told you, man, watch out for his Rubik. He's a sneaky one. He crept right in there and just stole that under the nose of Secret and sent it right back in their face. This means that they could come in from a different Indian's angle here, and the secret get a bit attack. too careless in the mid lane. Could get caught oh, potentially from behind. from behind. Mind control looking for the setup, makes his move. They pop it out, and they look to go for Pi. Meanwhile, the rest of the company, including Fatakuro and Jerex, look to make a move possible for Arteez. But no, it's Arteez he actually here. Turns around and shreds up Fata. Mind control gets a nice three man connection, and they dish out the offensive chain cross between the three, but they quickly dealt the split and avoid the trouble. A new chain cross flies out. This one from Puppy, but it does not do a whole lot of work. Meanwhile, Jerex gets hit with a timber chain and walks away with one of his own. And that's all going to be just for the tier one. Fata's is the only one to drop after everything is said and done. Yeah, I just played the Marana in quite a while. He's been doing all right. Not as flashy as some of the other uh, secret members, I'd have to say, but job's done. Quick to react with the Moonlight Shadow. Oh, yeah. Set up Arrow. And oh. he actually connects with this one. And uh, a reverse caster's curse possibly here, Waga. But my, walk, my control will be able to time walk away. The bulb is not done yet. He actually forces out the Chrono. Meanwhile, Meanwhile Puppy goes down, but Tumble Man's able to get the snipe on Little Lich there in the mid lane. Yeah, he found two supports, and Life here definitely shreds them really quick. But here comes Cavalry. Oh, Arrow. Bounty block. Arteezy. Arteezy. Smell my timber saw ass, is all he says. He's not going to allow him to pass whatsoever. And just bulldozes right on forward into the base. He is seriously a mech right here. Yeah, he's just chasing him. He knows he has so much armor to work with. He can't really be brought down by the towers alone. Radiance but, uh, tower is this is the tower. push coming here from Envy. So much agility now. The diffuse what Jesus, the damage. Arrow to fly out is so Radiance much work, and that is quickly going to be a tier three. Secret, no, they can with a win here. It's not going to get him in the upper bracket, but it will get him into a better position for Liquid. Seeing this one go down means they go down into that lower bracket and into the scary best of one. Yeah, nice stomp here coming in, but they can't really commit as they don't have life stealer. Gotta just sit back. Wave. I Wait. mean, Liquid have to defend eventually. They Liquid are corralled the together now down the staircase, and they're just heading for the pit. I mean, they're zoned out, and they don't even have TP <laughs> on uh, on one of them as well. They're just like, let's go in and let's go. They're gonna get it. They're gonna get the they rush. They got it. They grab it up. Arteezy steps in like, excuse me, what is happening over here? Makes a move in and he could quickly go down, pops up the low storm, is barely able to timber chain away. Meanwhile, Mind Control gonna get blasted right there with a fire blast and with the chain coming out from Puppy. Buybacks are gonna be forced here from Liquid now. And uh, Kuro, who stepped inside the pit, goes for a stop. We'll be able to get it off the pilot iron there waiting for him. Oh, does he get it? He's gonna wake up. Oh, he's got that splitter. Timber saw is going to be crumbled apart. And Envy, in fact, manages to die on bottom lane as well. At the same time, he was trying to rat. He got the tier 3 tower down. And, uh, yeah, he does get brought down. They should definitely be trying to go for the conflict here. Liquid take one. And now they're going for the tier 2. In this bottom lane here, a jump in from the Matumba. top man. Tries to go for Puppy once again. Puppy going to be forced back. Moonlight Shadow comes out. And Arteezy walks in. Pops out the Shivas here. Both Fada and the top man. Waiting back and behind. They're going to get him with the burst. And that will be the Aegis here. Now Liquid. Are they going to want to re-engage for this one? Trying to bail out the top of man. We all fought to get the set up for Bulba. Bulba going to be forced to go into a Yule. Arteezy just is out the shocker and Bulba's going to make it to the low ground. But Liquid now looking to disengage and step back and away. Jarex will take the high road here while Fata goes low. 
Him and Mike Control and the rest of Liquid will make their hasty escape, but it's end up running into Bulba World. They'll take down there. Yeah. Jarex still uh, kind of deep out here, but looks like he will not be spotted, and Liquid make it away with only a Bulba takedown. Wow. Upon us, the money continues to crumble in. The advancement of this net worth on the L continues to get higher and higher. Yeah, and right now, right now with all these items they picked up and Alchemist getting gear kept, now they actually should be scared. They have a reason to be scared because Alchemist got so much armor, you can't just burst him down with the terribly damage before. Uh, everyone everyone walks in there and then it's an instant chrono setup. They're looking for the target, but it's not going to be easily spotted. Fata totally withdraws from this one as Envy runs in. Kuro pops up the time slitter, but it's not going to be able to get connection. So Secret make their move. Arteezy joins our. Uh, Eternal Envy and making a catch. It's only going to be for Kuro, it looks like, as the others make a hasty escape. Jarex, though, still oh, lingering he around. Has a gem. He's been spotted, and as you said, he has a gem, which will quickly get snagged up by Secret. Secret managed to take that fight in the end, even though it was a hard commitment on the Alchemist that looked like it could backfire at first. Yeah, I think that would have been a good play. Oh, right now, Secret. They want to make a play with the Invis. Madama man, he's farming the Ancients nearby. Oh, so close. And the Courier as well, holding out on that Mount Everest. Oh, golden OD. Hi there. They find Matumba. And uh, they also see the Courier, and it gets taken down quickly there from Envy on the side. He puts full force on for Matumba Man. Him and Ortiz are going to be able to take him down. Matumba Man's out. Quick center for Fata. He's going to be low, and he quickly tries to retreat. If they lose him too, this could be bad for Liquid. Yeah, definitely. Kuro got to be the one to fall, though, to focus down on him. They settle for it. Cost of the chain and everything, but that is going to be Matumba Man out for nearly a minute without a buyback. Playing it a little bit safe. Of course, Liquid will have to back off soon as uh, mid lane is pushing in. You have to do something about it. Just sit here forever and uh, Secret know this. They're going to smoke up, though. All right, Secret. Let's see. They can move in, take a big fight. Take a big push in the base. Oh, Kuroki, not again. Finish up those Raxes. Oh, man. No chance at all. Arteezy spots Kuro, and just as fast as he sees him, he gets him killed. And he sees Jarex there, too, who's looking to sidestep the chakras, <laughs> but he has nowhere to run. He has to run right through him, but he is going to be able to make it back. It's not going to soften, but Tumblr is there. Hi. This. The high's moving in. Gets the two, gets the three. Multi Blaster coming on forward. They're going to be able to get the finish. Look at the army come out from Envy. Going to work on the racks now. No glyph seems to be popped yet. There it's going to be popped now for the damage, man. It has been done. Arteezy being the gatekeeper, forcing the rest of Liquid back it away, but Envy. He does the real job here and quickly is the demo man. He's already top. He's going for the space. He's running that way. The tier three already had half of its life. Liquid on the verge of not even being contended for tiebreakers and going right into the lower bracket, joining Secret there. One more kill as well, getting the life gear there. Really big pickoff. He is out for over a minute without a buyback, and they're not done yet. Arteezy looking for more. He is gatekeeper of the Fountain of Liquid as he heads right back and out, not allowing him to go anywhere. While, while Envy does the dirty work, the Megas are out, and I think Secret are going to block out Liquid from making it into the upper bracket. Secret with a beautiful comeback here after what has been a very, very hard few days. And look at that smile on their faces. They They're needed like, that. They like, needed finally, that. we got some good Dota done. They needed a series like that yeah. for a day. <laughs> it was just long overdue for Secret, but the... the